since 69 hits. Live at 4. Good afternoon, I'm Jim Vaughn. I'm Rob Vaughn. First to 69 WFMZ TV is the Lehigh Valley's number one TV news station with service that reaches as far out as Philadelphia. With this great reach though, you can still feel the care in the work and how friendly and welcoming all the employees are here. Brett Shutter, one of the directors here, described what it's like to work in broadcast television. That's one of the parts that I think is cool about broadcasting is that um, thousands, tens of thousands, depending on what, what you're doing, hundreds of thousands of people are watching um, the button you push, the camera you're working, the sound you're editing. It's kind of cool that everybody's seeing what you're doing for a living within a broadcast that are working on a team. But the team ends up being a pretty tight-knit group. Max Radnick, the director of the 4 p.m. show, explained to us how he loves building a show and then seeing his work come to life. Freddie, too. She's up. I think it's just fun how the show comes together every day. You know, collaborating with the producer and the anchors and our reporter. We like to have fun on, on the 4 p.m. show that I direct. Okay, four past four, here we are. Well, nice to sit here with you together again. We've done it a couple of times, maybe. Uh, maybe just a couple of times, so that's kind of neat. It's probably nice to sit in general for you, because I hear Wendy doesn't let you do that. My call anchor does not let me sit. So it's kind of a long story, and she'll, she'll be along. Getting as hands-on as possible with, uh, with cameras, or really wherever, like whatever you want to do, uh, just do it. Go out. Uh, if, if you're interested in, in shooting with a camera, go out and just uh, and and shoot around um, different things and experiment. If you're more interested in being an anchor, Jim Vaughn, one of the 4 p.m. anchors, told us how it's really important to be empathetic with the story you're telling. So one of the things that I think is important for an anchor is to be able to be empathetic, to be able to not just come across as a cold clinical reader or presenter of the news as if you're a robot, but I think people want to see that you're a real human being. If I'm gonna tell you a story about a, a four-year-old who just got killed by his parents, I wanna reflect that that shakes me up a little bit too. I'm not gonna crumble, but at the same time, I'm not an emotionless robot either. So I always wanna reflect what I'm talking about in a way that can connect with the viewer. I think that's really important. Jake Gillespie, one of the news producers, told us how each day can be very different and how it keeps his job interesting and ever-changing. Not every day is the same. You know, we don't come into work every day and just do the same thing over and over. Some days are absolutely insane uh, with breaking news and some days are, are a little lighter and, and you have to lean on, you know, kind of the, the more featurey stuff, the more fun stuff. Um, but it's fun coming into work honestly not knowing how your day's gonna go because it makes every day a little adventure. With all of these different jobs, it's possible for anyone to find a line of work that suits them in broadcast. For Broadcast Now, I'm Luca Petten.